Does ear candling remove earwax? Fact or fiction? Earwax is a common problem many patients face. When it gets particularly bad, it can be removed professionally by your local ENT. However, there are a number of other ways to remove it including flushing and for some folks even ear candling. Ear candling is a relatively common lay practice that supposedly removes earwax. Proponents claim that it literally sucks earwax out by negative pressure created by the burning candle. At the conclusion of the ear candling, supposed earwax can almost always be found within the candle. The main question is whether ear candling actually does what it claims to do. So here we have set up an experiment whereby an ear candle has been inserted into an empty glass cup. After lighting the candle, observe what happens inside the glass cup. After a minute or two, smoke can be seen coming out of the candle and down into the cup itself. Here's what it looks like from the inside. This smoke is actually candle wax debris and soot. Rather than a vacuum, it seems to be adding debris into the ear canal instead. Occasionally, some of this candle wax debris can be quite hot resulting in burns to the ear canal and eardrum resulting in eardrum perforation and pain. The debris itself can cause hearing loss by literally creating a wax covering over the eardrum. At the conclusion of the ear candling of an empty glass cup, the candle is opened up and voila, earwax is found. Only it really isn't earwax but rather larger debris of the candle itself that has fallen down from the burning flame. This just goes to show you that ear candling most certainly does not remove earwax. Rather, the earwax is created by the burning ear candle itself.